Hey guys, so obviously, as you can see, this is not our normal intro because this isn't a normal video. So we have had a very rough start to the new year. On New Year's Day, we tested positive for... Rona. Damn! Can't say the full name just because YouTube, you know, has their policies and all that. I had been sick for a few days. I had a cold. We didn't think too much of it because I didn't really have bad symptoms. So like we didn't get tested until New Year's Day because Isaac yeah. started getting sick and he had really, really bad symptoms. We woke up at around 8 a.m. and he was like, I haven't slept. The first night, I probably slept a total of like 30 minutes. I checked my phone every hour, 2 a.m., 4 a.m. And then I saw the sun coming up and I'm just like, no way. It was bad. Yeah. Second day, it was a little better, but it was still pretty bad. And it is now the third or fourth yeah, day. Third day third since day. we tested positive. On. I don't know how long we've had it for since before that, but today's definitely a lot better for both of us. Oh, yeah. He had a fever of like 101. Um, it wasn't like... No, it wasn't like that, but when you touched him, he was burning up. It's been a tough start to the new year, not being able to even leave the house, not being able to do anything around the house. I wish, actually, we're gonna show you guys our house. Like, oh my gosh. you're gonna see you guys how know bad that we're like clean freaks. clean freaks. But obviously when we're both sick at the same time, yeah. there's no one to clean the house. I mean, yeah, my parents did help us wash some dishes the other day. But they can't stay too long either because we don't want to get them sick. So it's minimal. And for me, I know like, I've been a lot better than him the whole time for oh me. Oh god, like it's funny because <laughs> they say that, you know, this virus, um, it affects people with asthma more than others and Andrea, you guys know, has really bad asthma. And she's been, not chilling, but like she's taken I've this okay. way better than yeah. me. And like, I'm the healthy, strong, <laughs> Never get sick, one. guys. Like it doesn't when, make any sense. When I told my mom that I tested positive, she was freaking out because like all my life I've had really bad chronic asthma and I was always really scared of getting the virus because of that because I thought I would actually end up in the hospital or something. So I have this little machine at home and I've just been using this to keep it stabilized so I've been fine thanks to this little thing. We both look like <laughs> shit right now. Oh my yeah. god. <laughs> How long has it been since we showered? <laughs> too I would long. Say, wait, yes, too long. Too long. Too long. Um, but yeah, we we <laughs> we just started to feel better, so I think we're gonna finally get up out of bed and start yeah. doing something. We've been taking it easy the past few days, but I feel like today we can actually get some things done. The room is such a mess. We haven't made the bed in like four days because we literally barely leave the bed. This is my nightstand. I have tissues all over the floor, freaking water bottles everywhere, medicine everywhere, cups. And then Isaac's side, he doesn't have as much things because I keep the medicine on my side. We have a freaking massage roller over huh? here, mugs, water bottles. And I know that doesn't look like a lot of water bottles, but we have a trash oh bag God. outside with like 30 water bottles. Here she is in all her glory. Hey, at least we've been drinking water. I think before we do anything else, we need to hop in the shower because it's been way too long. We are in desperate need of a shower, so let's yes. go do that. Oh my gosh, I feel alive. I feel so much better after that. Isaac? No, but we were supposed to be productive. You're the one that's feeling better. I'm still kind of. Oh, we're, uh, so you don't want to be productive? I do. What do we have to do? Oh my god, finally. You guys do not understand the satisfaction that gives me. Our room has been a mess for the past three days. We finally made the bed, um, but now we gotta tackle this situation. Room is clean, laundry has been started. Now it's time to clean downstairs. Where are you going? I'm the sick one. I'm not doing this by myself. Well, we're both sick, but I'm the one that's feeling worse. It's not too bad, it's not too bad. 
Hey yo, what the oh. fuck? <laughs> okay. Are you ready? Guys, this is crazy. Real quick, I just want to say, like, we traveled the world <laughs> last year and the year before that, and we never got this. We avoided it for three years. What are the odds of what us getting we, it yeah, now? Yeah, exactly. Like, that's so crazy to me. Just when you think it's finally getting better, you're like, there's no way I'm going to get it. We stopped wearing our masks, everything. Like, it's gone. It's over. Here we are. <sighs> All right, let's get to it. Guys, I don't know if this is a side effect of COVID or something, but I'm so freaking emotional. I just spent the last like 20 minutes crying. I don't know what it is, but I literally just feel so sad right now. What's wrong, Bella? I don't know. Why are you sad? I don't know. Hmm? I don't know. <sighs> are you sure it's just not what? that time of the month? No, seriously. I don't know. We haven't left this room in like three days. One thing that I told her the other day, I'm like, I'm glad that we have it at the same time. Even I know that's kind of messed up to say, like, I'm not saying like, I'm glad you have it. But like, imagine if it was just you with it and I couldn't be in here at all and you're by yourself. Right? Like, it's better that it's both of us. Yeah. We at least can keep each other company. Mm -hmm. We're going to be good. Oh. I've been trying so hard like the past few days to just be like positive and like whatever and one thing I was telling Isaac too it's like you know this job that we have is freaking amazing but when it comes to times like this we really can't just take days off like if you were sick from a regular and you had a regular nine to five job okay you get your vacation days you don't you clock out completely i feel like i'm still like clocked in no matter what i'm thinking like okay we need to post a video we need to entertain them we need to post it's been like four days since we posted anything like i don't know it's just stressful yeah but i know you guys i'm sure they understand yeah i know you guys care about us and yeah sorry that this video was kind of low energy and kind of negative i don't really like putting out that kind of content but this is, i mean we're real people and this is real life and we go through real shit so yeah that's all i have to say i'll feel better soon i'm normally not like this i know i'm not feeling the best but i am glad that we got up and got some things done today because that felt yeah. really good and i'm also happy that we shared this with you guys because it shows that Life isn't always perfect and happy, and even though we had a shitty start to the new year, we're not letting this stop us. As soon as this is gone, we're back on our grind. Back going crazy. Yeah. Like we said, 2023 is going to be crazy. But yeah, guys, keep us in your thoughts and prayers. That would really be appreciated. We'll catch you guys and, uh, in the next one. Peace.